Financial reform was also the focus of a gathering in Milwaukee today. And the key focus was the vice president. Fox 11's Mark Leland tonight brings us balanced coverage. As the halls of the Capitol get bogged down in politics over financial reform, Vice President Joe Biden came to Milwaukee to say the problems are bigger than just Wall Street. He says what happens there affects middle-class America right here in Wisconsin. When recklessness and greed on Wall Street lead to a financial crisis, every single America suffers the devastating consequences. And he told those gathered at UW-Milwaukee's business school that reform of Wall Street will work to fix our struggling economy. When financial markets are functioning the way they're supposed to, they create jobs, they create opportunities, and that's what builds the middle class. The Senate Democrats Monday night failed on a reform test vote. All the Republicans and one Democrat opposed letting the debate move forward. Many saying a rush to go after Wall Street could make matters worse. It falls short of our constituents' demands to prevent future bailouts, and it's expected to hurt America's job creators at a time when we need jobs most. The financial reform bill aims to create a system for dismantling struggling large firms. It would also establish a consumer protection agency to keep taxpayers from having to foot the bill of Wall Street mistakes. And it would require derivatives, instruments to hedge risk on Wall Street, to be traded openly. The biggest obstacle is probably the consumer agency and the reach and the scope of it right now. It's about making sure that when banks make mistakes, they take responsibility for those mistakes and that those mistakes don't hurt the innocent and the responsible. It's about ordinary middle-class people just having a fair shot. Biden found support in Milwaukee, but it's support in the Senate he needs to move financial reform legislation forward. Mark Leland, Fox 11 News.